Alrighty. Well, let me see here. Alright, first off. First off, this is the Boat Anchors Unlimited Net. We meet here every Wednesday night at about this time, somewhere in, in depending on conditions. Uh, it's 7.31 at the moment, so uh, I guess it's time to get started. First off, is there anyone who needs this Christmas piece for emergency use? Hearing nothing, we will continue on. However, if someone does have an emergency, we will relinquish the frequency request. Uh, we meet here every Wednesday night, and y'all know why. Because we got old radios, and we got to run them so they don't go down on us. And we like to work on them and have a good time with them and listen to the good audio from the 1960s and 70s. Some of them from the 50s. All right, number one on my list is Ron, KG5BZ. Go ahead, Ron. Yeah, um, good evening, Lynette. Not sure I'm being here at Herd Reg Power this evening with the thunderstorms and whatnot, but uh, I just want to list, I need the wall cord for a swan at M17 at uh, power supply. Uh, the wall cord that plugs the power supply into the wall. Thank you, Jay. Thank you, Fine. Okay, Ron. Uh, you sound loud enough over here. If anybody's got one to spare, Ron still needs a power cord for the Swan 117 power supply. The, you know, the one that you plug into the light socket. Anyway, uh, uh, his call is, oh, he doesn't have email. Just catch him on the air. I said wrong one. Uh, hey, I guess you didn't get it. Uh, let me see. Who's number two? How about WW9W? Oh, Jay. Good evening to you there. Good evening, everybody. It's Robert up here in Allen. Hope everybody's being safe out there and doing well. Oh, Jim and Dave and I had a good meet today. We had uh, had fun there. Hadn't done that in about three months, so we uh, went out and had a good time there for them. A couple of hours there, got a bite to eat and all. Out on the patio of the restaurant, had a good time. Sure did. Running the old Collins KWM2 here. I was on the 101, but uh, can't get it lined up so like I wanted. So, Jim and I will get all frequency here later on, maybe not tonight. Probably this weekend we'll get this thing all lined up. But right now, I am back on the old KWM2 with the uh, 301. Running looks like about 600 watts, 650 watts or so. Jay, appreciate you running it. And, uh, Lynn, if you're still listening down there, I know you got some storms coming in. Hello. So back to you, Jay, from WW9W. Okay, Jim. Well, most all of them 600 watts are making it down here. So that old Collins is down in great. She's got her gin in just fine. Uh, back to you. Number three, uh, Mr. Jim, KE5Q. Go ahead, sir. Yeah. Echo 5, Quebec, Jim, and Plano. I'm on the KWM 2301 tonight into the usual Ultimax uh, uh, 8040. And uh, uh, so uh, I'm using the Sure uh, 444. And yeah, I'd love to get out and get some lunch for the first time in three months. Uh, I am looking for a, a replacement. Uh, for my Swan 350, the one that belonged to my dad, it's, it's a 117, uh, 117 C. Uh, and uh, I'd, I'd like to find, you know, I wouldn't mind buying the whole thing. Somebody had a had a 117 C and a Swan, or just the power supply. So uh, if not, we're going to try to come up with something there. Talking to Rusty about uh, coming up with something possibly. And. Uh, Anyway, that's everything from here. Uh, back to that. Uh, KE5Q, Plano. Okay, Jim. Sounds fine. Of course, some Collins always do. <laughs> I almost regret If I still had room, I'd still have some. Oh, well. Uh, second, hindsight is always 2020. Mr. Bob, KE5CXG. Your turn, sir. Oh my goodness, Bob, are you out there? Maybe not. Uh, N5BTM, how about you, Ralph? Yeah, hello, 
Hello, Jay and the net. KM5QS and the group in 5 bcm Uh, good all. This will probably be kind of short for me tonight. I hear the rain down there and the raindrops on the roof. So, uh, tonight we are running the Heat Kit Out Hot Water 12A and uh, driving a uh, homebrew uh, linear uh, GS35B Russian tube. And we're doing about 800 watts out. And we're using a 444 Shure microphone going through an MN2700 tuner. And uh, uh, those central electronics, we may be able to, if, if the heat kit don't beat the central electronics tonight, it's like the college guys might. So back to you there, Jay, and maybe you can keep counting them. Otherwise, I think I'm going to go ahead and get out of here since it's rubbing a little bit. BTM. <laughs> okay, okay, Ralph, I understand. Uh, I, I don't know if we're going to get any tonight or not. We've had enough for a while, but it's uh, sounding great down here. Uh, even over the... Still getting you through the two All right, let's, um, where am I at? Five EDX, Byron, your turn. is percolating, what they usually do. Uh, I'm going to get one more, and then I'm going to pass it on to Rusty, I guess, uh, let him pick up some. But I have uh, N5DAR down here. How about you, Mike? Go ahead. Well, good evening, Jay. I'm not on the, uh, the old 520 sugar tonight. Uh, it's out there in the shop, and I got a bunch of stuff to be able to out there trying to rearrange the antennas and this and that and the other. So uh, I'm on the Anon, that's the SDR radio. I just chimed in here to say hello to everybody and kind of maybe give somebody a, a frequency standard, as it were. I hope it helps. But anyway, um, I, I, I checked in, what was it, two weeks ago on the 520, and it was still working good. I have the whole station now. Except for the 6-meter transverter. I have the 2-meter transverter, uh, all the other station accessories. Uh, I'm still looking for a 6-meter transverter. I don't know if I'll open it. But what the heck, you know. Anyway, that's all that's uh, going on here. I uh, uh, worked a lot of different stations on 6 meters. The bands have been real. The band gods have been really good here lately. So, anyway, thanks for letting me in here, Jay. Uh, I'm not, I'm not uh, on the old one, but I'll get back on here shortly. Catch y'all later on. Thanks for letting me in. N five D A R. No problem, Mike. Yeah, everybody's welcome most all the time. So, and uh, that being said, I didn't say what I'm on tonight. I'm running the Kenwood Twins, the five ninety nine Delta, into an Alpha three seventy four A that's been converted to a pair of three six eight hundred using an Electro four six sixty four A mic and a homebrew antenna open wire line and um, the bird was not authorized to say that but he did anyway so rusty take it over before the bird eats me up <laughs> okay jay uh km5 qs wk5 r let me get back on Ron, 
on there before I get started. KT5BZ, are you there? He's gone, okay. Well, I sent him a cord, but it went to a P.O. box. That's the only address I had. All right, um, I'm just going to throw it out there because I don't have any on top of my mind there that were there. Anyway, I'm on the HT37. Microphone is a WRL. Uh, Sound off SB44 microphone. I'm dropping the Homebrew GF35B amplifier to the fan dipole. Uh, no tutor. That's what I'm doing. All right, who else for the boat anchors unlimited? Come now. November 5, Julia, Julia, India. N5 JJI. Good evening, Ed. Good evening. Well, I'm here on my standard uh, Kenwood TS530 head. Uh, into a clipper to nail, out the window with coax straight to a 80 meter dipole up about uh, oh almost 50 feet, and uh, just an old cheap hand mic that seems to match up well with this radio. So that's the status here. Looking forward to hearing a bunch of guys in here tonight. N5 JJI. All right, good. Uh, the old 530 uh, sounds good there, and the hand mic's fine. All right, who else for the boat anchors unlimited? Come now. Kilo 5 X-ray Bravo. Kilo 5 X-ray Bravo. Good evening. Yeah, good evening. It's K5 X-ray Larry. I leave my Alfa Romeo Romeo Yankee. I just got that in where he says it's not. I have a Juan 350 Alfa barefoot and to a double bazooka dipole. Roger. Where are you located at, Larry? Yeah, I know right where you are. I'm in Wells Point, so we're almost neighbors. Oh, yeah, we've talked before. <laughs> All right. Uh, appreciate you checking in. The old swan sounds good. All right. Who else for the boat anchors unlimited? Come now. Oh, November 5, Echo Charlie Papa. In November 5, Echo Charlie Papa. He's to be here. Hello, Jeff. Hey, what's going on, kid? as far east as we can get, at least in this And we're hopefully getting out of this rain. Nothing, there'll be something good tonight. Robert sounds good. Of course, he always does. I heard him the other morning on uh, two-meter sideband, so things are looking up. Roger, Roger. You running the old gear there, Jeff, or are you running uh, up uh, modern stuff? Well, for a moment, I've got the Kenwood 2000 here. Studio B, we've been putting up antennas there. Um, before long, we'll have everything set up out there. Roger, Roger. Well, good to hear you. It's been a while. <laughs> I never will forget that time me and you and Frank had breakfast down there uh, at I 6 and, and uh, I, I mean, Highway 6 and I 10. Yeah, we missed that old stinker. <laughs> that was a stinker back there, wasn't it? I appreciate you checking in. We'll catch you later. I'm going to see who else is out there. All right. Uh, who else for the Bone Anchors Unlimited? Come now. Hey, good evening. All right, talk to us.
What a beautiful day in Timer. That's about it. Back to you, Rusty. K zero. Okay, Steve. Yeah, uh, the Kingwood sounds great there. Always does. Uh, yeah, it's a beautiful day over here today, too. I'm kind of tired because I was packing up a radio, uh, four piece, <laughs> uh, FT 107M station. It's going to Oregon. I sold that rascal. Anyway, that's a You get it all together. All right, who else for the Boat Actors Unlimited come now? You're going to have to try it again. Ah, uh, Enzo G, uh, GVQ, I believe it was. Or GVK, go ahead. Did you lose your amp, Rusty? Okay, I'll take a few and uh, maybe you'll get a running before I run out of pizza. <laughs> That'll be better. All right, anyone else for the boat after Sunland uh, tonight coming out? Maybe I lost my receipt. Oh, yeah, the Arkansas station, he was just in and out for the count. 
Oh, okay. That's couldn't quite pull him out of it. Let me let me try this. Um, K A W O Z. Dan, are you out there? Evidently not. Already. Uh, w five I S. How about you, Doug? It's not. Uh, anyone uh, for the Boat Anchors Unlimited decision on this uh, <laughs> stormy night, I guess, come now, please. Maybe a short nap, right? Well, it could very well be. I can't imagine. No. Mm -hmm. uh, I wonder where Mike is, KL7 CD. He might have some storms down there. Well, shut. Sure. I got a bunch of, well, Austin. No, Austin's under the gun. That's why, that's why a few of them are, are not here. They're, uh, they're getting some weather. Well, you go ahead and see if you can uh, wrap up a few, because you have better luck than me. Thank you, Mike. Uh, Rick, I mean, excuse me. You're right. Never mind. Thank you. <laughs> you don't want to know. <laughs> anyway, thanks, Rick. We'll uh, see you later. Anyone else for the boat anchors? I'm living. Well, it sounds like it's going to be an early evening, fellas. So, uh, this is the last call from my station. So, Anyone we've missed, had to talk to, and I have to keep that or anything like that, come down to me. There you are. I called you a while ago, but I guess you must have had to go to the refrigerator or something. Go ahead, Bob. That's exactly where I was. Um, and I cut it too short. Okay, if I say it's Steve Bob outside, we'll walk it along with a bad back next week. Appreciate all everybody that checked in. And uh, I'm going to let Rusty tie the final ribbon on it. So, the seven threes from KM5QS. KM5QS, WK5R. Yeah, all right. I'm out. I'll make one last call. Anybody else we up there we had not talked to yet that's in the sound of my voice and wants to check in today? Boat Acres Unlimited Net, come now. I hear 
to nobody, so I would, uh, sir, appreciate everybody checking in, because Jay and myself, Lynn, who's uh, ducking thunderstorms and lightning right now, and uh, uh, Guy up there, over there, or, or Jim down there at Uvalde, when he can come in here and help, we uh, wouldn't be able to do this if y'all didn't have these radios on there. You know what it takes to keep these things up and running. Appreciate y'all checking in, and we'll come back next week, and we'll do it again. This is WK50 with the now clear and return the frequency to normal amateur abuse. And I'm going to two meters or the two meter net. See if it's going. It will be that way. Thank you, Jay and Rusty and Ralph. That radio sounded great. I'm going to shut her down here. It's uh, popping and snapping all around me. N5 JJI. Okay, Ed. Boy, you're loud down here. <laughs> it's working well for you. I meant to tell you last week, that 530 sounds awful good, but they usually do. Well, I appreciate it. I, I put a couple other radios on here, and I always go back to the 530. Well, let's, let's see. I'm torn between the, uh, the Twins and the 830. I had a 530 SP, but a friend of mine wanted to say I had to sell it to him. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, I didn't have room for a whole collection anyway. Yeah, you just pat it on the fan and say goodbye. But that's about it. It's going to be good. <laughs> but anyway, all righty. I'm going to go see if Mama's forgiven me yet. For, uh, I, I kind of went to her. She went to trouble to cook dinner, and I kind of ate it kind of quick. Let's so see if she stepped out. And... Sure was good ice cream. <laughs> that is a uh, uh, H-E-B brand. Man. What's she saying? You watch your mouth. This is David. Oh, <laughs> I'm thinking of this just because I figured out my damn speakers were on. Don't feel too bad. That happened to me a couple of times. I finally, I finally just took them out of line and put them in a cabinet under the deal. And I never use them unless all the radios are turned off. Well, uh, I have my headphones on, so I'm wondering where the hell is this echo coming from? And then my wife comes in and says, uh, yeah, uh, it sounds funny. <laughs> they don't make enough ferrite to get those, keep those amplifiers picking that stuff up. Right. So I got to go check on Mama. Uh, <laughs> I, I hope she can cook it tomorrow. Anyway, see you next week. See you next week. All right, well, come on back.